Hi, welcome to the first video of the forehand course, where we're going to be looking at the forehand from the most important part of it, the contact point. At contact, my wrist is going to be laid back so I can make contact this far in front of me. You'll also notice how far my elbow is from my body and how my arm is relatively straight so I can make contact with the ball this far from my body. Now when we take our racket back, we're not going to change anything that we've already established for our contact point. So that way when we go to make contact with the ball, all we have to do is time the ball. Here I am from just behind the service line about to hit some balls. And you can see I'm in the racket back position, which means my racket is pointing to the back and my body is turned sideways. You'll also notice that my arm and my racket face are already in the position I want them to be in for my contact point. Now that I'm hitting the ball, my arm and my contact point need to cooperate with each other. So you can see how far I need to get the ball from my body so that the position that my arm starts in doesn't change throughout the stroke. You can also see that when I swing, my weight is transferring from my back foot to my front foot and I'm lifting the heel of my back foot to allow my body to rotate properly. And if we freeze here at my contact point, you can see that my body is now facing the net. So now if we take it back to the racket back position, you can see that my body is just rotating towards the net to get to my contact point. From this angle, you can see how far out in front of my body my contact point is. And you'll also notice that my left arm is extended out across my body and it's just catching my racket after I make contact with the ball. And that's just, in, just ensuring that nothing is changing with my right arm and my racket face as I follow through. From behind me, you can see that I'm just focusing on the things that we've been working on. My racket face and my right arm are staying in the same position that they're starting in all the way through to when I follow through and catch the racket with my left hand. My weight is also transferring from my back leg to my front leg so that my body can rotate. And you'll also notice that I'm not doing very much with the ball, which is what I want at this stage. I just want to develop a solid feeling with the ball at contact so that I can get consistency with my forehand.